Hey guys, good morning, happy 4th of July. Sabah al-khair, kayf kum, aid del istiklal al-sayid. U atman alikum yom sayid. Al-hain bin roh parade. Right now we're going to a parade for the 4th of July in Orleans, or Orleans. Orleans? Here in Massachusetts, in Cape Cod. It's about 15 minutes from where we live. Ehna raihain, the parade fi Medina ismha Orleans. O muntaka ismha Orleans. And it was surprisingly easy to find parking. I did not expect that. We parked just off the main street. And we arrived about 30 minutes before. I think we arrived around 9.30. And we went to get coffee. Oh, this little puppy. He's so cute. Welcome to Corner Store. I tell you, they did great business on the 4th of July. Everybody who was going to the parade went there just to get coffee. So the line got pretty long. It's supposed to start at 10, so... You guys can see across the street, Home Port Restaurant. That's where we're gonna have brunch. Should be good. Oh, and they don't take reservations, which is kind of good because I feel like in Cape Cod, you've got people who just sit by the phone and make reservations like a year in advance, and it's just really hard to get a reservation same day or like even the day before or within the same week or two weeks if it's like around the summertime. So the place that doesn't take reservations is actually kind of good. And it's 10, so it should start any minute now. The kid with the blue jacket and the blue glasses was so <laughs> cute. I think he's like the highlight of the parade experience. You'll see. Candy. Oh, good. Thank you!
I love it. That was the end of the parade. Brunch time. Yeah. Home port. I think they're open until like 2.30 p.m. because they're sp specifically for brunch and lunch. I was thinking, oh, I'm gonna film the menu for you guys so you know what to order when you go there. It's very extensive. It reminds me of the Cheesecake Factory menu. I mean, not that long, but it's just very extensive. And to be honest, the food was great. I mean, I'll show you what we got, but um, really, like, it was it was really good food. So, and it started to get really busy when we were there. I mean, right now we were lucky to get a table, but it got a really long line. Strawberry croissant, french toast. Oh yeah, that's so and good. omelet. Yeah. After brunch, we went home and chilled for a bit before going back to Chatham to see Jaws. Hey guys, good afternoon, happy 4th of July. We are heading to downtown Chatham area to go see a movie that was filmed on Martha's Vineyard, Jaws. We're going to see a film in the cinema 
اسمه جاز والفيلم كان مصور هنا وفي مارثاز فينيرد في جزيرة مارثاز فينيرد Oh, but first coffee. I don't know why I was just still really tired. So I think I got like a macchiato. It was very good. The worst crime in Chatham today is parking outside the line. So you see that car is getting a ticket because they're just over the white line. See, like there's the white line outlining the parking. Um, I actually got a ticket for the same thing in LA once in Westwood. But you see like this guy, he probably has a ticket. So we'll see how much it's for. Did he get a ticket? Yes. Yes, he did. Okay, how, how much is it for? I'm curious. Yeah. It's 50 bucks. So, so you guys can see. It's not our car. I'm just, oh. just curious how much the fine is. How much is it? 50 bucks. After some walking around, we decided to go to this restaurant. Red Nun Bar and Grill. This place was recommended to us by multiple people. We waited about maybe 10 minutes for a table. It wasn't that bad. So that's one of the best margaritas I've had in a long time. It's and, true. I'm, I'm not lying. The margarita was amazing. I have no idea why I did that. <laughs> Thank you. I mean, the food was good too. The portions are very big and it's quite heavy. How do you spell it? Koha. 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 That's what it is. Q-U-A. Q-U-A. Koha. So thank you so much. My local favorite. And this is the kale and artichoke dip. This is the kale salad. And this is the, um, I think it's the seafood. Oh, those are fried oysters, I believe, with sweet potato fries. So good. A lot of food. And I don't know how we ended up getting dessert, but it was a lot of food. It was good, though. All right, time to go home and watch fireworks. We were lucky to find fireworks near our place, like just on this random pier. We could watch fireworks, you'll see. Nice, right? And that's day nine.